Our big game coverage road trip starts off in Bear Country, winds up in Poe, where there are pirates. Let's take you to Pirate Country. That's where we find our Larry Ramirez. Arg. Hey, Greg, I knew you were going to do that. You know what? The wind was really whipping around tonight on the BGC road trip big time. That meant that running was the name of the game. Let's go. The Bears charging the field, all fired up to face Somerset tonight. First quarter, Bears ball after picking off the Bulldogs. Handoff goes to Garrett Brandt. He finds a hole thanks to his lineman. You can kiss him goodbye. He's taking that baby 54 yards to the house, and the Bears lead 7 to nothing. Ensuing drive, the Bulldogs answer right back. Quarterback Cole Detmer throws to Chase Denton, and he powers in for a 16-yard touchdown, and this game is tied at 7. Welcome to Flowtown, Floresville. Tigers hosting the Lockhart Lions in the Battle of Big Cats. First quarter, Tigers ball. Quarterback Braden Fuller fakes the handoff. He keeps it, runs to his right. He hits the sideline, and folks, he is going the distance. 75-yard touchdown, and the Tigers lead 12-7. Fuller is a bad dude. And here's a shout-out to the student section at Jack Lane Field here in Pope. They are loud and proud, and we love them. The Pope Pirates hosting George West. Third quarter, Pirates ball up big. Handoff goes to Jaden Fangman on the jet sweep. He runs left, hits the second level, cuts back to his right at the 25, makes a defender miss, and Fangman breaks off a 52-yard touchdown to make it 49-0. Pope Pirates fangs out. Let's go to the scoreboard for those finals. Somerset goes on to win by a final of 21-14. to Floresville wins 40-27, to and right here, Pope knocks off George West 56-7, so Pope is now 6 and one overall, 4-0 in district, and those points are the first they've allowed in district this season. They've outscored district opponents now 187-7. to Greg, back to you.